When a radioactive substance emits into radiation, some of its atoms decay into another element or another isotope of the same element. Let m denote the mass of the radioactive substance at time t. Experimental results show that the ratio dm dt to m is a constant. So dm dt to m is a constant. So that means dm dt is equal to k multiplied by m, so which is the result here. All right. So we know that the mass is decreasing, and then hence we will have dm dt to be negative. So k is negative as well. So and then we learn that for this differential equations, the solutions would be m equal to c e to the power of k t. And then in the previous examples, we know that this c is the initial mass of the radioactive substance. That is why we have this as the particular solutions of this differential equation.